Hi, it's Brian Newman with the Spotlight of Business Owner Show. And today we're thrilled to have Michael Clendenin with, uh, he's a digital marketer. So hi, Michael, how are you? Hey, I'm doing good. How are you doing? Yeah, good, good. So yeah, before we get into the business that you're in, can you tell people a little bit about uh, your background and how you got into to doing what you're doing? Yeah, so so I originally did advertising in the music industry. So it was my job to book bands, get bands on the bill, and then get bands to promote themselves and teach bands how to sell tickets. Because, you know, if nobody shows up to the show, the show doesn't get publicity, nobody makes any money, the bar doesn't make any money, or the venue doesn't make any money, the bands don't make any money. And so it was my job as I kind of got older to to work with promoters and helping them promote not only the bands that that were playing on the bill but like bands that were on a, like a, a retainer oh cool right so i tra- so funnily enough i was doing that in my early 20s and then my friend his name is austin Fennell, i still remember this to this day asked me to help him write an ad to help him sell his car uh-huh. and so and so being you know the normal you know, person that I am, I was like, well, yeah, I'm going to hit up Google. And I hit up Google. I was like, yeah, how to write a good advertisement. And then it just kind of went from there. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah. And that, that was how many years ago? Uh, so in, so in January, that would have been five years ago. So I actually started oh. in January of 2016. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, very cool. Yeah. No. So what, uh, you know, everyone, you know, there's a lot of marketing companies out there, just like there's a lot of business shows out there that I'm doing. You know, right. what makes yours unique compared so, to the other ones? So one, you know, I'm a paid advertising specialist. So so my job is, is you give me a dollar and I'll give you that dollar back plus a customer or I'll give you one and a half dollars more, right? So, so I don't do any, I don't do anything where it's like free publicity, free business stuff. My stuff is all about scaling and sustainability versus someone who's just starting out. Like if you're just starting a business and you're trying to promote your business through like free events or anything, I'm, I'm a, I'm a strictly like, let's write some direct response advertising. Let's do some email marketing. Let's do some social media marketing on Facebook or Google or YouTube or whatever it may be and then let's get that going right Uh uh-huh oh wow yeah Yeah, no so uh, that's what i was going to ask you what are the various services you offer i I know you know marketing companies you know some of them that i know you know like one specializes on linkedin one of them Mm -hmm. specializes like strictly on making videos and uh, i know when we first met or talked you know you do what, like copyright, uh, original uh, content or something like that, or? Yeah, so so the, my very first skill, it's like a, like all Marines are riflemen, right? So all marketers, in my opinion, should be copywriters. And and if you if you think back to like really like the Revolutionary War, uh, have you ever seen a, a printing block press where they take a piece of paper and they stretch it out and they take some they oh, take yeah. some wooden blocks right and they roll the ink over it and then they and <laughs> clamp it down and pop it back off so the yeah. guys who wrote that stuff the guys who actually wrote what would go in the ads because it was being copied onto so many different pieces of paper they call the copywriters mm. um, but all that really means is is i'm the guy who writes the ads themselves so i'm the guy who writes the sales pitch i'm the guy who writes your video script I'm the guy who writes your website copy, you know, the words that are on your website. Um, I come up with how to, how to, how to like frame your offer, but really, you know, what I focus on the most with most businesses is the three basic functions of marketing. And so like the first function is, is to generate leads, right? If you're a leads based business, uh, you're a realtor, you're a, a uh, salesman, you're running a car dealership, right? And you need a lot of leads. I I will help you build a lead generation campaign. The second function of marketing is to convert those leads or people who are aware of your business into customers, right? And then the third and and probably the most important piece of marketing is customer retention, 
right? Because mm. if you're if you have a customer and only buys from you one time, that customer's value is very low. Mm -hmm. And so if you're if you're spending money on ads, you want your customer value to be as high as possible. Because if you're spending twenty dollars to acquire a customer, you want to make twenty dollars back, plus you want to make a profit, right? Mm. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So so I set up all of the processes within businesses to do that, like like. For the last year or so, I've been working with a lot of chiropractors. And so chiropractors, I don't know if you know this or not, but chiropractors have a hardcore customer retention issue. If oh. you come in for an adjustment and you come in a couple times, it's very likely that you're going to drop off. It's actually statistically, I don't know what it is, but statistically, if you walk into a chiropractor's office, you're probably going to stop seeing that chiropractor within 60 to 90 days. Right. Oh, wow. So, and so not only is it up to me to write the ad to get you in the door, it's also up to me to write all of the material that follows up with you. So all of the emails, all of the coupons, all of the uh, flyers that they send home with you, all of the way to get referrals. I do all that stuff. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. Yeah. No, that's interesting. Um, do you have a, an office here in Phoenix or is it uh, all online or how do you meet with your clients uh so so generally if like if we're meeting face to face right like i have a rental space that i use but since covid happened i haven't really been using it uh i work remote right just like oh, okay. anybody else yeah oh, okay yeah i know uh yeah with this covid thing it's caused a lot of people to go online i know including myself you know yeah. but uh but so yours is strictly remote now yeah, I'm, I'm almost, with the exception of one client, I am almost entirely remote. Wow. Well, I know uh, before we went on the air tonight or today, yeah, yeah you were telling me that you've, you've had a lot of customers, uh, not just in the Phoenix area, but all over the place. Can you tell us about that? Yeah, yeah. So, so actually, the very first client I ever took on was from Perth, Australia, believe it or not. Um, but, but yeah, so I've worked with people in Australia, I've worked with people in London, um, I've worked with people in Singapore, uh, and I've worked with people all over the U S so, so the majority of my business is completely remote. Oh, very cool. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, Michael, can you let people know again, how can they get in touch with you? Yeah, actually. So, so, um, for being so grateful for allowing you to, to let me do this, I actually set up a little web page last night where, where you can actually have me do a marketing analysis for your business for free. Um, wow. And so you can just go to michaelclendenon.com forward slash free analysis. So it's just F R E E A N A L Y S I S. Uh -huh. And then, and then you can type in your information. It'll, it'll ask you like some really basic questions, you know, what your name is, what's your email, best way to contact you, what type of business you have. And then I'll go ahead and actually give you some feedback on your business to see where you can strengthen your, your sales process and your marketing process. Oh, perfect. Can they call you? Is yeah, it... you, can, you can call me. Please don't call me at night. Please call me during the day. <laughs> is this the right number? Yeah, that's the right number. 480-798-2495. Yep. Oh, okay. Okay. I know some people, they don't like to get calls. You know, if they do, they do texting. You know what I mean? But I know uh, yep. some, pe some people, like you have to set up an appointment with them, you know, because they're so busy. I forget the name of the system they use. Yeah. But, well, uh, I use Calendly. Um, oh, that's it. But yeah, I use Calendly. But yeah, I mean, you know, I mean, if it's going to be an hour long conversation, we should for sure set up an appointment. But but if you're if you're calling just to see, you know, who I am or you want to learn more, I'm more than happy to take your call. Oh, OK. OK. Yeah. So what uh, you know, uh, everyone's got an ideal client or customer that they have in mind. Who would be yours? Someone who isn't advertising right now and who wants to, because, you know, when you enter in like the later stages of a business as a business owner, you want to turn your business into something that is more of an investment instead of a hobby, 
right? And so if you're a mark or if you're a business owner and you want to be able to take a thousand dollars, put it into your business and have a thousand or more dollars come back out, you need to have an advertising and sales process down. Right. So anybody yeah. who isn't doing that right now, who wants to start doing that, I'm I am your guy. Oh, OK. And I didn't know. Uh, what about like small businesses versus uh, larger companies, you know, like that have many, many employees? Like there's also a lot of small mom and pop uh, businesses. Yeah. You know what I mean? Right. Do you have a preference or? Well, so with larger businesses, right, you're going to want to scale. So you're going to want to scale your advertising, um, which I'm equipped to do that. I also know a lot of media buyers who are very good at that. But yeah, I'm more of, I'm more of, are you a coach? Are you a consultant? Are you a small business who wants to do more in your business? Um, I can, I can blow your bottom line out of the water. Right. Okay. Yeah, yeah. no, that sounds good. Um, uh, again, what's the best way for people to reach you that website? Yeah. So just, you can go to michaelclendenon.com uh, forward slash free analysis for that analysis. Um, you can also just call, call me or email me. Um, I believe, yeah, my phone number's on the screen, but, but you can email me at michael.a.clendenon at gmail or call me at 480-798-2495. Oh, okay. Yeah, Michael, so uh, just in closing, yeah, are there any last pieces of advice that you want to give to people that are watching? Um, sure. So, so if, if you're, I mean, if you're a business owner and you're a new business owner, or you've always been afraid of, of advertising because you feel like it's a gamble or you've lost money on advertising before, I actually have a perfect system for new advertisers to make money immediately. And it kind of deals with, with getting old customers to come back. Um, so if somebody's interested in that, I'd be more than happy to walk you through that process too. Well, okay, okay. Yeah, so uh, again, give them a call, 480-798-2495. That's an easy way to, to get in touch with them or that website one more time. So it's just michaelclendenon.com forward slash free analysis. And Clendenon is spelled just like I have it. Um, how, how do you spell it? Oh, so it's so it's actually C L E N D E N E N. Oh, okay. All yep. right, sounds good. All right, well, Michael, yeah, thank you so much for being on the show. Good to see you, and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Yeah, thank you, Brian. Okay.